So we're going to try and help out one of our viewers. Come on over, sweetheart. This is Megan. Hi. Hi, Megan. Hi. How are you? Megan and Megan, vice versa. I'm sure you guys met backstage. Yeah. So what was the goal here in you two working together and collaborating? Well, I really just have a problem with um, cellulite, you know? Even I could work out, eat clean and everything, but it's still there. And that <laughs> is the key. By the way, cellulite is hereditary. We are born with it. Doesn't matter what you're eating. But we all wanted to try and do something to reduce the appearance of. And there is a recipe in my book for a bath soak. So basically, the base is um, almond and jojoba oil, which are very nurturing um, and soothing for the skin. And then We've got um, grape, grapefruit oil, which is really kind of the hero of this uh, concoction, which is basically, it's an anti-bloating agent. Um, it's really My gonna God, help. I'm gonna live in yeah, grapefruit oil. It's really, it really <laughs> helps with um, water, getting rid of water retention. And then we're also gonna use fennel oil. Fennel oil is chock full of antioxidants, which is amazing. And then we're also gonna add in um, some lemon oil, which is uh, fully replenishing and nurturing this for your skin. This smells like an actual recipe. You're I mean, gonna, it smells beautiful. You're gonna really add does. all of these in here, and then what you're gonna do is put the whole thing into a dropper bottle, and you're only gonna use about 20 drops of this into a bath mixed with Epsom salt. So you're gonna soak in that bath for about 20 to 30 minutes um, and you, once you make the concoction this is going to last you for at least about 20 baths wow. um, so that's great and something it's a whole that, lot of soaking you're going to be doing so yeah clear your schedule well you know soaking is also a great time to either read a book catch up on emails and epsom, and epsom salt yes. will help with the detox oh too. absolutely yeah. and you want to sweat out all of that stuff that we are preparing your body to sweat out because before you're going to get in the bath you're going to dry brush and this is really going to help with the circulation it's going to help move that lymph and it's gonna help detox. So this is what you're gonna to do to prepare yourself and your body before you get in the bath to get all of the good stuff that's coming from this concoction. So I'm just gonna show you how to dry brush. Sure. Do you mind? Okay. So you're gonna start on the legs and you're gonna go in an upward motion towards your heart. And you're gonna do this with a brush that has natural fibers and something that's not too rough because it obviously can hurt to dry brush your skin. And you, right, and you, you don't want to damage your skin. It's totally. an organ, it's a living, so breathing organ. So you can do organ, this right? on your legs and then you can even do it on your arms. Everything going to the heart. <laughs> 